There's more to the world around you than you might think. We are surrounded by countless molecules, little pieces of matter which affect every aspect of our daily lives, from the oxygen in the air we breathe, to the nutrients in our food, to the DNA in our cells, which determines the traits we pass on to our children. By tracking, analyzing and manipulating the molecules around us, we can better understand how our bodies work and how to fix them when things go wrong. Take our blood, for example. Blood is a rich soup of molecules which sustains the trillions of cells throughout our body. We can already detect some molecules in blood. You may be familiar with the sensors that diabetics use to track their blood sugar levels. But we want to move to the next stage and be able to detect molecules that are a million times more scarce in a drop of blood than sugar while keeping this technology accessible and affordable. Nanotechnology will be fundamental in creating the next generation of sensors by harnessing the remarkable properties of matter at very small scales. We struggle to see the molecules we're interested in, even using our best optical microscopes, but when the molecules enter the small space, or nano gap, between the components in our sensors, we can determine what the molecules are and what they're doing. The latest nanotechnology and nanoscience research from the University of Cambridge allows us to design and create new sensors, which you may see in hospitals and your home in the near future, such as the intelligent toilet that can help track your health. At the Mind of the NanoGap exhibit, we'll be exploring how extraordinary materials like gold, graphene, and even DNA can be used to enhance our sensing capabilities. And you can get involved in our research by participating in our survey exploring the ethical issues surrounding the sharing of medical data. Join us on a journey to find out more about how nanotechnology and nanoscience research is changing biosensing at the University of Cambridge Mind the NanoGap exhibit.